Hi there. You alright? Yes. Welcome to Burns Surgery. Oh, this is your first time here? Okay. Okay, would you be able to tell me what's wrong today? No problem. That is absolutely fine. No, honestly, it's okay. You don't have to go into detail. That's fine. Um, I will need to sign you up today as a new patient here, just because we cannot see you if you aren't signed up and as a patient at this um, doctor's surgery. So is that okay for me to continue and do that all for you? Yeah? Honestly, it doesn't take long. Uh, so it will be just this bit of paper. Um, we can fill this out together if you like. Yeah? Okay. Um, and once this is complete, you will get a telephone call and we will tell you when we can fit you in for an emergency appointment. Does that sound okay? Yeah. Okay. What's... Okay, I thought so. Oh, okay. No, that's fine. I will try and... We can try and do this really quickly. Alright. Okay. So, I just need your first name. Okay. And your surname. Okay. Is that with... Okay, okay, okay. Okay, thank you. <laughs> that's fine. Um, do you know your NHS number? No, no worries. Oh, <laughs> that's okay. Oh, um, do you have a previous surname or is that... Okay, no, that's fine. Yeah, okay, no, that's fine. Please may I take your postcode? Okay. And your house or flat number? Okay, yeah. And the uh, line of the address, first line of the address? Okay. Okay, 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 that's done. Got that one. Um, could I take your... So I need a home work and mobile telephone. So, are you, can you provide all of those? Okay, yeah, we'll start with the mobile. Okay. When you're ready. Okay. Yep. Yep. Okay. Perfect. Do you have a work number we could take? No, that's absolutely fine. And a home telephone. Could I take your date of birth? Perfect. And you are... Yep. Uh, what's your marital status? Okay. No problem. And your country of birth? Sorry, I'm trying to go quick as possible so you can be seen sooner. <laughs> Don't want to miss anything off. Uh, your first language. Okay. And do you have a second language? Okay. Um, okay, so the next set of questions are quite personal. If you feel uncomfortable answering any of these, then just let me know or we can simply just stop and um, not do it and someone else can come and uh, help you out with this if need be. Um, so yeah, I'll try and go through it as um, efficiently as I can, but um, again, if you have any problems, just let me know, okay? It's alright. Okay, so are you a carer? Okay. That's fine. Um, 
Um, I just need your ethnic origin. Okay. No problem. And could I take the details for your previous GP? Yeah, so the one before here. No, we will not transfer you over. This is just so we know, so we can um, send them any results, any information that they may need. Um, yes, we will also get any information that we need from your old GP also. Okay. Do you have the name? No, that's fine. Yeah, I can take that. Okay. And the telephone number? Yeah, you can look it up. It's fine. <laughs> don't worry. I know we don't expect everybody to know all the numbers. <laughs> okay, you ready? Postcode, have you got it up? Yeah, okay. Yep, yeah, when you're ready. Yep. Got it, perfect. Thank you. And what's the name of that one? Okay. Is that with an S? Yeah, okay. I never know if it has an S or doesn't have an S. <laughs> it's one of them ones. Okay. So the next section is just your medical history, so if you know this, please let me know. If not, don't worry about it, it just makes it easier for our doctors. Okay, so what is your height? Okay. And what is your weight? No, that's fine. No, no, that's okay. We can work that out. No worries. How much do you smoke if you smoke? Okay, no, that's fine. No, good. <laughs> that's okay. Um, how much do you drink? Okay. Yeah, you don't seem like the type of person. <laughs> okay. Um, well, so those ones aren't applicable because you don't smoke. Um, what is your occupation? Okay. Perfect. How much exercise do you take? So, do you do any classes, or do you go running, or do you just walk? Okay. To be honest, I think that's enough. Yeah. I mean, you know, more, more the better, but equally that's just as fine. Yeah. Um, do you suffer from any allergies or intolerances? Okay, no, that's fine. Um, okay, I'll, I'll note that down. Yeah, we can always test for that, yeah. Okay, no, that's fine. Um, you don't have any allergies, medicine, or anything like that. Okay, okay. Perfect. Okay. Um, is there any family history of heart disease, um, or any other condition? Okay. Okay. No, that's fine. Honestly, if you don't know, if you don't want to tell me, that's okay. No worries. If there you do have any queries or any issues at all, you can just speak to one of our doctors when you see them, okay? This is just so we have um, as much information as we can to save time in the appointment, alright? Don't worry about that one. Okay, now I can pop that down. Yeah, that's fine. That is the first side done. Okay. So we just have this last side to fill out and we will all be done here, okay? So, do you have any regular medication that you're on? Any at all? Or if you take any paracetamol? 
or anything. Okay. Okay, thank you. Um, any others? Okay, no, that's fine. Okay, so the next question um, is if you've had any serious illnesses, operations, x-rays, or any other tests, or has anything else, have anything happened to you, have you broken any bones, have, um, do you often get um, sick, or anything at all? Okay, um, mm -hmm, I can pop that. How long ago was that one? Okay. Yep. And how long ago? Okay. No, no, that's absolutely fine. Thank you. Um, did you have any x-rays? Yeah. Okay. Um, Okay, so we've just got the vaccination list, so we just need to know which ones you've had. If you are unsure, that's when we'll contact your GP to make sure that, you know, we don't give you an extra one if you've already had it or if you had it when you were younger. Yeah. Do you know any that you've had? The te okay, tennis. Okay, that's fine. Have you had the MMR or DTP or mumps or... Polio or rubella. Okay, no, that's fine. I can pop a question mark next to that one. Okay, I've just circled all of them that you mentioned. Oh, okay, and you've had that one. Okay. You had that one at school? Okay. No, that's fine. The more you tell us, the better. Yeah, okay. Um, not much more left, don't worry. Um, okay. So... Okay. So, the next section of this is just to tell us about anything that you have, any queries, any issues, any problems, and we just need to um, state uh, why you would like to see the doctor, any issues that you think are happening, would that be okay? Okay, just, you can just do it in detail, it's absolutely fine. It's up to you. If you want to do it in detail, that's okay. If not, then don't. Honestly, it's fine. It's fine. But yeah? Okay, okay. Um. Oh yeah, I can, I can see. Okay, um. Yeah, I can pop that. Um, is it painful, irritable, itchy? Okay. Yeah, okay. No, that's absolutely fine. Thank you, that's, that's more than enough. And the last section is just to say that you sign and you agree so i will read this out to you okay so summary care record the summary care record will contain your allergies reactions and current medications we have already filled this one out this can be shared naturally with those medical staff who had a leg legitimate reason to look at your record with your permission 
so if we have any concerns we would like you to um, sign this so that we can um, share this information with your other GP and any relevant um, doctors that we think will need to know this prior to your appointment so that just says that they can have a look at your allergies and your medication to ensure that you know we don't give you anything with these in to um, protect you okay if you wish to have a summary care record you do not need to do anything as this will happen automatically and be created from your GP record so we will do everything we will provide this and we will we will do the work for you okay um, if you do not wish to have a summary care record then please ask for an opt-out a form you would like one no worries this can be done at any time so if you do change your mind you can opt in and opt out and if you have any other query you can visit us on our website at burnsidery.co.uk okay um, so this form should be completed and handed back to me that we have done and I just need you to sign and date it in one moment um, do you also have with you your any identification perfect no that's absolutely fine so we'll just need that um, and I will scan that through for you just after we filled this out okay and that is everything okay so I will take that off as you've got that yeah no worries so I just need you to sign this now okay no worries that's it <laughs> Oh, you just need to date it. Yeah, that's it. Ten. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Um, I will also just countersign this to say that I have done this with you and I have read for everything. Okay. So that is the form all completed. The next part of this, we will just need to see your identification. I will pop it on the system, and then. We are all done we will give you a phone call when we have an appointment ready for you we usually do them same day but if not it will be tomorrow is that okay perfect if you just want to step aside my next colleague will just go through the identification process whilst i do the next patient okay no worries i hope we manage to um help you and i hope that you have enjoyed um, our service today okay that's it if you just step aside alright